Well, it's another beautiful day. I decided to try another garden vlog, even though my last ones haven't got many views. It's going to be a stream of consciousness, whatever comes into my head, although I have thought of a few things to talk about. I have no idea if I'll end up talking about them or not. I'm doing a lot of thinking about my channel and the future of it. It doesn't have much to do with this uh, change to Hulu style on YouTube. I see I'm bouncing around again. I've got to stop bouncing in this thing. Um, it's hard not to. <laughs> uh, where was I? Um, crap. Going on uh, two years of having my channel, and I, when I started the channel, it was never a thought to cross my mind that I would have put up a video. I was just uh, frustrated from from watching videos for like three months. Building up gradually. I mean, I started out watching maybe one a week, and towards the end of the three months, I was watching who knows, 10, 20 a day. <laughs> but I was frustrated at not being able to put my two cents in with the comments. Anyway, I'm sort of coming to the conclusion that I really suck at this. I may not suck as bad as I think, or I may actually suck worse than I think, but I think I suck. <laughs> and I really haven't managed to say any of the things that I would want to say if I had a form. There are all kinds of things going on getting get in the way of that. myself, would I take myself seriously in the YouTube format, and chances are I wouldn't, so I kind of wonder what's the point I've managed to garner somewhere over 100 subscribers at this point after not quite two years. legitimate subscribers. And now YouTube won't let you unsubscribe channels that are that are gone because they've been closed or suspended. For a while they were they were they were deleting them automatically and I think that lasted for like uh, what a week at the most. Now you can't delete them even deliberately. So even though it says I got 145 subscribers it's somewhere over a hundred maybe less than a hundred dollars it's hard to tell half of them are trolls people I don't even want to talk to um, I don't know if there's a point now, I don't know if it's situational or experiential or generational or what but after two years of doing this, well, not quite two years, I'm still not bloody comfortable sitting in front of a camera and talking. I may, I may never get really comfortable. As soon as I turn the camera on, I, I start to get a higher heart rate, a little bit of adrenaline pumps in there, my brain starts to go into semi fight or flight mode. I can't, can't really pull it all together on camera. I'm not sure why some people are able to do that well and other people aren't. But I don't think I'm one that's destined to be able to do that well. A 
I've also noticed lately that I don't seem to be easy to understand, and I think I think it has to do with my dental problems. I'm going to the dentist this week. God knows how much I'm going to end up spending, probably around 10k. I haven't been to the dentist in three years, and I've got lots of problems. I think this is interfering with my ability to enunciate certain words. <coughs> So we'll see if that makes a difference, maybe. I forgot to even consider when I started this video running. I sort of get the sense that I'm going to let this go for a while and maybe get several videos out of it. See if I can talk about something that makes uh, some sort of sense, coherent, uh, a coherent subject, some sort. Of, um, on the subject of YouTube and what YouTube's about. Probably everyone's noticed this uh, kid, uh, Christian YouTuber, I don't think that's the username. I've, I've not paid a whole lot of attention to it, except just to take note of the, the extent to which the kid was getting trolled and uh, recently the effect of that. Gotta, gotta say, the kid won. <laughs> the trolls lost, the kid won. Thanks to thanks to all the hate this kid got, he's uh, he's been mentioned by all kinds of YouTube celebrities. He's got 1,200 subscribers in like a week. Uh, I think he'll be on TV probably before long. Uh, so that's a win for the kid. Loss for the trolls. Of course, the trolls always lose. Best, but the best a troll can ever achieve is to prove to the world what a real moron he is, or she is. Uh, but that does go to the point of what, what YouTube's all about, doesn't it? People would uh, would much rather see some angry kid saying, I am not a homo, then listen to me blathering about the ethics of or anything philosophical. Even the amazing atheists, excuse me. Even the amazing, even the amazing atheist. I think that was my dental problems. Is changing the format or content of his videos now to be more Fred-like in, in the sense of being just total nonsense instead of anything substantial. Same thing with Saturnine Films. He's all he's all artsy fartsy now. Forget his uh, his political stuff, which is what I subscribed to him for. Not that I agree with everything the guy said politically. It's pretty naive in many respects, but he did have something to say that was worth saying, and he was very good at saying it. Now it's all this art crap. <laughs> 